and G-Rod on stream now. Yeah. So, hopefully this one doesn't end the way the last one did, but damn, that was funny. Hold on, I'll be right back. I need to report that score. Go for it. <laughs> yeah, now we're going to be having, um, we're going to be having, uh, I believe it's G-Rod versus Stan? G-Rod versus Stan, yes indeed. You guys are good to go! Oh, they, they probably didn't hear me, but I'll let them know. Yeah, we're good to go. Alright, here we go. We get game one. Stan versus G-Rod. Last match of today. Yeah, late. No, there's one more after this. Oh, one more? Actually. Okay. Yeah. Easy clap. Uh, we've also got uh, PGX versus Curry on stream after this. There you go. So Stan and G-Rod going at it now. We got some jabs coming out. Stan taking an early lead. Stan's Fox, very reliant on those burst options, uh, which you won't always get against Lucas because he's drifting everywhere so quickly. Mm -hmm. He's making that space very fast. Yeah. So Fox getting those dash attacks, it's entirely reliable or reliant rather, entirely reliant on G-Rod coming down with an aerial. Gets that forward air though, he's got some good damage going. The neutral air to ledge trap, great option. But G-Rod fighting his way up with the forward air. Lands safely. I wonder how G-Rod's gonna play this matchup though. I think he's playing it the same way he plays most matchups. For sure. <laughs> Which is, uh, you know, kind of dash in, dash out, get those, uh, Side B's. Yeah, try to see if he gets some type of reaction going too, you know? It can hear me. Uh, all right, yeah, I'm just making sure. Yeah, yeah. You got the headset on. You ain't at the <laughs> yeah. mics. So, got the side B coming out from G Rod. Mm -hmm. Now he's going to try and ledge trap, but he lets stand back on stage, eats the back air, and that's going to wow, be the first what? stock. Yeah. Bad DI, I guess. Maybe. I mean, it's a strong move regardless. It can kill pretty good. Yeah. So, it could have been a lot of different things. Hits mm -hmm. the Nair. Uh, Stan not oh. overextending on his combos, knowing that Lucas can escape a lot of those combos due to his you know, lightweight and drift speed. Yeah. Go pressuring with the jabs, the cross up into the up tilt. Great idea. G Rod again, fi fighting his way off the ledge with the forward airs. The hexagons coming into play. Rod trying to space Stan out, catch a landing, catch an approach. Dan getting the angle to the ledge, but he gets parried. No punish. Some lasers coming out, trying to force the approach. I think Curry is going to hop on commentary with us oh, before he nice. plays his match on stream. So I got to take mine out. Yes, it works. But that one does work. I did put right now. Up three. Yeah, G-Rod actually, this is surprising because he's beaten Mega Fox in a game before. Oh, G-Rod's beaten Mega Fox? Not in a set, it was a, a but game? it was a three stock to three stock game during a crew battle. And okay. so it was, I mean, he beat him clean. And uh, this is really surprising now to see him getting beat like uh, like this. But he's going to get that set up. Yeah, nice. He's got that confirm on lock for sure. He's he so said good it's not it. a true combo though. You can actually air it. I believe it, but I mean, you almost don't even know you're getting hit by yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. So fast. Side B. Getting his back ears in and <laughs> falls right into the fox jab. Killing each other and getting the nair conversion to uh, forward air. You're all getting caught by the fire fox. Now he's trying to keep his stage advantage. He's been not too good oh, at keeping patience. it. <laughs> I think he was looking for up to upper. This is actually like prime percent. Right. Maybe Stan doesn't know. Erod's in a lot of trouble for sure. Ooh, trying to catch these options. Bringing this back. Yeah, the down smash. Such a potent ledge trap option or a ledge guard option. Yeah. Sorry. Does the B reverse with the uh, side I'm, magnet? I'm feeling a rent. Oh my oh, gosh! You say? called it. You called it. Well, it didn't land, so uh, he's got to keep looking for that Fox kill. Erod getting in the neutral air. No G follow up. Erod can still bring this back. It's Lucas. Man. Fox being the third lightest character in the game. That was near up smash right there. I don't know why he didn't go for the, the scare. He was probably set on jumping regardless. Yeah. Heals a little bit. Not going to make much of a difference, but it might. Against Fox, who has trouble killing without some of his most potent moves. You know, like, they're all unsafe. They're all... Well, I don't Back know... Back air is Yeah. Back air is... I don't know. I think Nair is kind of safe, too. Depends how you cross it up. They know you're going to cross it. But yeah, probably... Okay. Good chase. Sneaks in the up air. Yeah. Yeah, and of course, uh, Lucas being 
uh, floaty kind of character. He's stuck in the air for a while. So Stan just chased him down, got that in, got the kill, and now he's up one to nothing. Crazy because Dan has been. Yeah. Yeah. Rod being the second? Uh, he was seated third. This second. I was. Yeah, I seated oh. myself second. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but but it makes sense because you I, I beat everyone except no, for the first seed. Yeah, exactly. So no, I, I backed it up. I actually didn't know that you played this game. I do. Okay. I do. I just don't enter brackets except for my own tournament very okay, much. Okay, okay. Uh, and Stan switching to Wolf. Interesting choice. I think he might have got, you know, a feel that G-Rod was learning how to play against his Fox. And now he's switching to this character. Uh, both of them are very safe, but yeah, Wolf yeah. even more so. Wolf even... Wolf is the most safest dumb character, <laughs> but no, I think um, the reason why I think because he's no who's had was likely pop. Because look, it's already racked up eighty, um, keeping him out completely. Almost got that if he did down smash it. Yeah, and he's spacing him out completely with the. Here we go, the ledge trap with the neutral air. Fox loves using that neutral air to ledge trap. It's such a safe option, covers so much. And nice forward wow. to on the ledge. I think that was a two frame as well because I don't think forward to beats uh, up B from Lucas, but because two framing cancels out, grab the ledge. Right. Uh, F now nice. Stan's got to start being careful with that laser. It seems like G Rod has caught on to his timing on shooting those, the spacing at which he's going to do it. He's trying to throw out that side magnet ev almost every time. Yep. No, Stan's wolf is moving right now. He is keeping him out completely, but G Rod got him off stage. This is where Lucas can excel, but drops the edge guard. Yeah, he kind of gave up all the stage control trying to throw out that freeze. Greedy dash tech. Back throw in. Let's. A okay, good awareness from. Yeah, just a little bit of damage there. Uh, not going to be the kill. And of course, he gets That's back on it. stage, but that no, throw. Wow, that was some sus DI. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. I don't know. It's a strong throw, but I, I don't know if it would have killed, actually. Yeah. Kind of spaced away that down. I think he was trying to cover roll. He was just a little bit closer. He could have covered both options. Now we got G Rod coming down with the back air and that up air safe on shield. That connects so. G Rod trying to fight his way back. He is down by 100%. But you know, it's Lucas. Lucas can do this. <laughs> right. And there's the buffed up airs that are coming in. Combos into itself a lot more. They uh, reduce the end lag on the move so it can combo into it. I don't know if it got stronger or does more. Three times. <laughs> <laughs> don't know what that one was for, but uh, who knows. Maybe it was a bait. Yeah, could have been a Ah, uh, God. Air dodge is perfectly you know through that. I haven't seen from us. Uh, and uh, the up smash. What's up smash? So hard. Oh wow. I wow. Me. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> we, yeah. we might want to talk quieter. <laughs> That's why I like try to tone it. Up smash is really But he's getting greedy for these kills and loses a stock. Yeah. Here on, you know, got hit. Um or got put into a bad situation and Stan I have to find an answer to take this stock. Right, you saw G-Rod catch the dead trap with his dash attack. No tech coming from Stan, and now he's trying to fight from behind, struggling to get this kill. Lucas at 163%. He called out the jump, but the up air came out faster than Wolf's back air. That's right. Timed it just a little bit off. Oh, after Stan really has to find this stock. Lucas's rage is really scary. Throws are killing earlier. Moves connect probably better, honestly, for Lucas, considering low percent combo. Uh-oh, yeah, he's off now stage. that looks true. Oh, he's going to be a him. lot of damage. 95 after, like, that. Oh. Dan deciding, uh, sorry, uh, G-Rod deciding not to catch the landing with the grab, that and now he's got it. the freeze. Yep. Stan was not wanting to try uh, going into that ledge. Like, here, tur let's, turn the, let's turn his knob up a little bit it's over okay. here. No. Are you? Are you going to get off? It's all right. Curry says his throat is hurting. Hey, dude, I'm in following. 
Yeah, that's that's right. That's right. That's all that you. That's that's it. All right. Soda. Anyways, so now it's one to one. G Rod took that game. Seems like he made some good adjustments. Stan now going to switch characters to Falco. His Falco is very good, uh, and he knows exactly when to throw out those combo starters, when to trap landings. He's he's got this Falco down. Even to tech itself either. I think I'm just loud, honestly. No, like, it's barely even picking me up. Wow. I can ride into it. That's something. All right, yes. Oh, I know. So, we got an up tilt to back air coming out. Hits him with the laser. D-Rod trying to find his way back on. He uses the tether recovery. Almost gets caught with a back air, but not quite. Dan's neutral with Falco. So interesting. He's got a good lead. He's doing those jumps into forward air. Tries catching the tether, but he's instead going to catch G-Rod jumping off of the ledge with the back air. Now Stan up a stock. Comes in with the forward air. Another forward air gets Stan off stage. Going for the down smash, it's not going to connect. But instead punishes that up tilt with the back throw. Again, not quite. He's going to go for the back air. Misses it. Goes for another one. Gets that one that time. Fantastic edge guard from G-Rod. Timing those bears perfectly. And now it's an even game once again. Forward air comes out. G-Rod's got no jump. But Stan not capitalizing. Neutral air. Playing some space out game, the G-Rod gets his way in with the neutral airs. Puts Stan on the platform, Stan makes his way back down. Now some more neutral airs coming out, goes for a back air but not quite getting it, goes for it again. He's just looking for these spikes, oh my gosh, and G-Rod almost getting them. Instead, they're both back on stage, and with Stan going for a combo, neutral air catching G-Rod, oh my gosh, and he just goes out there. Fantastic pressure, fantastic chasing from Stan. He's now up a stock when he was down. In the back air, again, G-Rod timing that one perfectly. He is not, he didn't get the last one he tried for, but he got that one. And now again, even game these two putting on such a good match this time. Oh, outspaces Falco. G-Rod with a good lead, about 50, no, 55%. A neutral air. Air dodge is out of the confirm. Good job, Stan. Actually, I guess it's not a confirm if you can air dodge out. Air dodge is out of the setup. Air dodge is out of that one, too. He's caught on. He knows now. And then G-Rod getting the forward air. Almost killing Stan, but not quite. He's going to go for the freeze again, but this time Stan deals with it r perfectly. G-Rod whipping a grab. Stan has to be careful with these lasers. He's shooting them the wrong way, and also G-Rod can absorb those. Both the people find their way back to the ground after being in the air. G-Rod trying to take this stock, but he's having a little bit of trouble doing it. He's in the air now. Dan, putting on the pressure. Oh my gosh, he went for the grab and didn't quite get it. That grab could have been big up there on the platform. Up throw to up air could have possibly killed neutral air from G-Rod. Throwing out the freeze. Oh my gosh, and he does side B into back air. Bates out an option from D-Rod playing that ledge game, re-grabbing. And now, Dan is up 2-1. to one. What a clutch play to bring that back. He had all that rage and Falco's back air being such a strong kill move. D-Rod wants to win this game. Has G-Rod lost to anyone? Other than, I guess he's lost to me and Curry, right? I think he's lost to me and Curry, so I don't think he's got any money going his way, but he wants to have a good showing against Stan. Stan has only won one set today. Of course, lots of talented players in the building today. For only having six people here, we have some very good players. Uh, yes, okay, so I was correct. Um, oh, wow, the parry on Fox's side B. Yeah, Stan switching back to Fox.
all those up tilts coming out from Fox not going to work as well on Lucas. He can escape the combo so well. Gerardo, G-Rod, making such good use of that Zare. He uses it to catch jumps, he uses it to land. He uses it as a double jump cancel. Tried to catch Fox with that back air, but he missed it. Up air coming out from Stan. Almost going to kill G-Rod, but not yet. G-Rod having to recover. Goes for a tricky angle and doesn't quite get it. That was such a risky move by G-Rod, but he almost got it. He teched the stage and was just a little bit too far. Or sorry, too close to the stage to get another uh, move out. Goes for the spikes, doesn't quite get it, jumps way too high above the ledge. Up air's coming out. From Stan, now he's coming in with a neutral air. One of Fox's main neutral and pressure tools, that neutral air. G-Rod again using the Zare just to get off of the ledge. It's two, two stocks to two stocks. Uh, G-Rod with about a 50% deficit here and climbing 60% now but he gets the neutral air find his way back down to the ground Stan calling out an option with F smash forward air from G-Rod no conversion on the landing oh my gosh Stan missed that up smash forward air coming out again G-Rod loving that forward air Got to find a way to make something happen. That up smash whiff was big. Sorry, I believe it got shielded, actually. Z-Rod completely still in this. Only about 15% deficit now. He's trying his best to make this back. Stan not finding the back air. G-Rod smart, drifting out. Who's going to take this stock? It's a big deal. This is possibly the last match of the set. G-Rod refusing to die. 122 now. Neutral air coming out. Stan often has dropped shield on that neutral air. He cannot find this killing blow. 130 now. 139. 140. G-Rod now has Stan off stage. The back air. Not timed right. Goes for it again, but misses it. Gets back. Oh, and he eats the back air. Finally, Stan has taken the stock, and he's in good position to take this set. Two stocks to one stock, and G-Rod's now got to find this kill. He has to be careful, though, not to focus too much on that killing blow. Just find the hit, the down smash, catching a landing. He's going to go for the freeze, but misses it. G-Rod healing just a little bit off that laser. Eating that one, though. A grab from G-Rod could do it now. He's going for that forward air. Oh my gosh, and goes for the Zare into the grab, but he doesn't quite get it. Stan going above the ledge, dealing extra percent. And now Stan with all this rage, if he does not die soon, this is going to become... Oh my gosh, an SD. Commentator's curse comes into play, and now G-Rod's only at a 35% deficit. It was looking like it was going to get a lot worse than that just a second ago. G-Rod punishing the multi-jabs with side B. Spacing each other out, trying to force an approach. Both people kind of scared to get close. G-Rod comes in with the neutral airs. No conversion off the second one. Back air spaces it perfectly. No punish available from Stan. Dash attacks, trapping G-Rod's landings. But that time, G-Rod managed to escape, but a grab comes in. G-Rod heals a little bit off of Fox's laser. Neutral airs coming in. He almost got a back air. That was so close. Playing the neutral now. F tilt. G-Rod has Stan in the corner off stage. What's the option? Stan just side B's back onto the stage. Landing. G-Rod makes it onto the platform underneath. Stan now. Stan with a 50. Oh my gosh, both hits of up air didn't connect. I don't know if that would have been it, but it would have been scary for G-Rod for sure. Gets the grab now. Stan off stage. Close game. Goes for the down smash, and that one's going to hit. What a close, intense game. G-Rod is not out of this set yet. It is 2-2. Two two. The down smash was all it took. 
He finally had Stan off the level, got that crisp setup into the grab. Stan did not react to the down tilt on shield quick enough, threw him off stage, and then set up for the down smash. Stan wanting to side B, actually up B, trying to stall, but G-Rod just charged the smash. So again, it is now 2-2, two to two, Stan to G-Rod. Here we go, last game of this set. After this, we have Curry versus PGX on stream. Starting off with a reflector. Stan going for that for uh, probably PK Fire, trying to reflect that. He has now switched characters, I believe, four times during the set. G-Rod healing a lot off of that blaster. Stan has to be careful about that. But he's racking up good damage now with these wolf combos. G-Rod coming in with a combo of his own, only 25%. PK Fire canceling out the blaster. That time, the blaster sneaks right by the PK Fire. These two are playing so patient. There's not going to be a whole lot of true punishing in this matchup. Wolf being so safe and G-Rod spacing with Lucas because of that drift being so impeccable. Forward air coming out from G-Rod, a cross up into PK Fire, and now G-Rod's got a slight lead. Stan takes it right back. Back air keeping G-Rod off stage. He goes in with the tether, but the neutral air on the ledge trap, such a good tool. And Stan is throwing it out at all the right times, except for that when G-Rod fights back on stage with a forward air. Dash attack, catching G-Rod's landing. G-Rod on the stage now, getting caught by another dash attack, not quite killing. Up B from G-Rod, gets him back on stage. He back throws Stan, snuck it in there, and with that rage, that's going to kill. G-Rod now has a lead in the last game of this set. Getting the neutral air conversion. Oh, it goes for the unsafe jab. Stan's going to grab that back throw, not killing. G-Rod trying his best to make it on stage. He's kind of cornered here, though. Blaster comes in. And the dash attack again, not killing so close, though. 189% on G-Rod. He's got all this rage and the down tilt, I believe, from Wolf going to catch the ledge. Killing. Down tilt from Wolf, killing. Who would have guessed? So, G-Rod was just at that high percent, and now pretty close to even. Stan did a good job of not taking too much percent before closing out that stock himself. Super close game. 31% to 47%. Now, Stan at 47 just dealt a lot of damage to G-Rod, and it's coming up more and more. These aerials kind of walling out Lucas. He's getting tossed around from side to side of the stage. Air dodge is out of Lucas's grab setup off of uh, the down tilt. Oh, and he shields the down smash, but of course it's Wolf. It's safe. Goes for the forward tilt that time. Maybe that one is true. The grab isn't. Goes for the down smash. G-Rod. Only 2% separating these two. Both at about 100%. He gets a grab that time off of down tilt. Up throw. Not going to kill. And that time he does a pivot back throw, catching Stan's approach. G-Rod is again in the lead. Stan brought the last stock in pretty well, but oh my gosh, he just shot a blaster and G-Rod healed. He's back down to only just 100%. A neutral air coming out from G-Rod, but now he's off stage. Got caught by a wolf back air. Tries to go for the tether, tether but he misses it. Now he's trying to up B back onto stage as long as Stan times these F tilts properly. He's got it. He's timed three in a row now. Perfectly. G-Rod, how's he going to make it back? That one caught. Sweet spotted. And now, Stan doing such a good job of closing out these stocks before too long, trying to keep the game close. G-Rod's just been taking the stocks earlier, but again, now Stan has a lead. This game is so close. Game five, guys, between Stan and G-Rod. Stan doing such a good job of cornering G-Rod for a while, but G-Rod managed to sneak his way back into center stage. Now he's got some traps going. Stan spacing an F-Tilt perfectly. PK Fire coming in. G-Rod still with about a 30% lead. Only down to 15 now. Back air coming in. F-Tilt from Stan puts G-Rod off stage in this corner situation. 
G-Rod sneaks past a back air, gets back to center. This is so close. How are they going to deal with this? 2% again separates these two, but Stan sneaks in a dash attack. He's got the advantage. Misses a neutral air. Uh-oh, the back throw from G-Rod. Now, the one off stage is Stan. He gets caught by the PK fire, and that's going to be it. G-Rod with 109%. Super clutch, throwing out that PK fire, expecting Stan to jump above the ledge, and he did. Close game five set. Great play from these two players.